Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the Tech Sport Guy, and I'm your host Abhishek Sharma. So today in this video tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to reset your phone and get rid of this annoying shit, which is the um disabled. So if you forgot your password, if you have forgotten your password, but you couldn't um you couldn't um restore. So it um because like if your phone and um, if your phone uh you know like physical button is not working, for example the power button or for home button. So in order to go it into the recovery mode to restore your phone from the iTunes, uh, you do need to have your home button working. So if you don't have it, I think you I think you have to take this one to the uh, Apple Store. They will fix it. But if you don't want to go there and you know like make an appointment to do that one so you can do it at your home so i'm going to teach you how to get into the recovery mode if your home button if your physical button is not working and without um, um button so for this one it does require a computer and the itunes and also it's required some uh, small piece of software i'm going to be mentioning you in soon so yeah let's get started so now i'm guys i'm in the computer you can use your mac or windows i'm using the mac so I'll link this uh, uh, link in the description below. Just go ahead and check that out. It's gonna be in the description below. Go to this site, and once you're on this site, just scroll down to find the download link. Scroll down as you can see. You should find the link to download. You should see Rec Boot, uh, Rec Boot for Mac or for Windows. Just click on your operating section. I'm running the Mac, so I'm gonna click for this one. Once you click on this one, as you can see, it's downloading. Finish. Just scroll, click on Open. So once you click on Open. So as you can see it's downloaded finished I'm just gonna click on the open so as you can see if you get this one just click on the open so as you can see it's opening oh and make sure your phone is plugged in so it's logged in so yeah okay so you should get you should get so something um from the items just click on the cancel and close the items for now so once you click on this one just click on the done check this is the software that we uh, um, need to have so as you can see it's running and you should see unknown mode uh, slash device detect detected once you're in here just click click on the inter recovery once you click on the inter recovery you should see your phone um, it's um, it's going off you should see some uh, you should see an apple logo in here so just gonna wait for this one as you can see there you go you should see apple logo now you should see the iTunes so once you click on the iTunes, you should get some prompt from the iTunes. This is uh, there is a problem that uh, doesn't matter. Just click on the restore update. I'm just gonna click on the restore and now click on the restore and update. If you didn't get that message, just go to the iTunes and in the iTunes, once you click on the iTunes, you should see something like that. So if you didn't get the message, open the iTunes. iTunes, you should see something like that. Click on the restore iPad and click on the restore and update and it should down it should da start downloading as you can see it start downloading i'm gonna come back when it's feeling it's kind of big file it's 1.50 gig so i'm just i'm just have to wait for some time so i'm gonna be back when it's finished hey guys now i'm back as you can see it's still downloading it's nine seconds seven seconds remaining so yeah just gonna wait for it so as you can see now you should get something like that you should sit update and restore button here and you should see um iPod or uh, you should see down button here. Once you are in here to update your iPod without reason, just click on the update. But in the in this case, we have to restore your iPod or iPhone or iPad in order to get uh in order to you know like get into the phone because my our phone is um, we our phone is uh, locked. So yeah. So now just click on the restore. Once you click on the restore, click on the restore and update. And as you can see at the top you should see extracting software it's not gonna take that long but I'm gonna be back when it's finished if you have your items is still open you should get like this one welcome to a new iPod you can just click on the download or continue for in my case I'm just gonna close out of this one so I'm just gonna exist quit the iTunes now let's wait there you go guys now you can unplug your phone so yeah unplug now let's run the setup so as you can see just click on the uh, language set up your language country religion I'm Australia I'm living in Australia so yeah, I'm sharing language setting. Hey 
Hey yo, I'm on the new welcome to the iPod click and get started. So there you go. They have it your new iPod touch or iPhone or iPad. So just gonna go into the setting and just gonna check which version I'm running. So there you go, I'm running the latest version 9.3.3. So yeah guys thank you so much for watching this video um if you like this one video if this video was hope um helpful please don't forget to like this video comment share with your friends and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel just click subscribe to my channel and make sure to turn on the notification so you can get the uh, notification my new video update notification just turn on the notification as always uh, stay tuned for um, videos um more videos gonna be uh coming soon in the future so and yeah so i'm gonna be making more videos on the uh, iphone so yeah don't forget to check it so yeah subscribe to my channel and i'll see you next video bye bye peace